Hey guys, welcome to the RevitKid.com. So today I'm going to show you a quick little tip in scheduling. <clears throat> what you can see here is we have a door schedule. I just quickly set it up in a uh, temporary project. Um, and what we want to do is we want to start grouping uh, some of our columns. So for instance, the, the frame and the frame type, let's say we want to put them in a column, maybe even fire rating. Let's say we want to put all threes in, three of these in a column called frame. So if I select all three, so all I'm doing, let me do that again, is I'm dragging across my left mouse button and selecting all three. I'm right clicking and I'm saying group headers. Now you'll see um, a, a header popped up, it merged and centered, and now you can type in here and you can actually type frame. <clears throat> and now let's say you want to do the same with the width and the height and the finish. Or actually, let's say, uh, let's just grab, you can actually do it with multiples if you grab a cross. So now we grabbed a cross four and I right click and I say group headers and you can see it actually pops it above these we can say something like material and vice versa so you can go around grabbing all different areas in the headers and you can rotate these as well and this way you can create uh, grouped areas and have uh, more successful schedules I hope this helps and I'll talk to you guys soon